Good people, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good night. Welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Jen. This is the first time that you are seeing me. Thank you so much for stopping by my return subscribers. You are the best. Thank you. So today I had news breaking. That is this news. Mm. You know, during election time, they were carrying uh, 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 your president, the INEX select. They were carrying him like uh, you are carrying a baby diaper. They were carrying him everywhere they go, they will give him injection. Everywhere they go, they will perfectly or something. Eh? So that one no carry and go. No, that one no carry and go. You know what thing go carry and go this time. Now the aeroplane. <laughs> God devil, you are a liar. People with all the money, all the money, they are locating to themselves. They, that is it. The people hate themselves so much. I can't say they, I can't say, I, I don't even want to talk about the ones they hate us. But they hate themselves, including themselves, including the plane, the motor they will get it. They are locating the money to themselves to fix the plane. They swallow them. My God, <laughs> they swallow the money, the trillions and trillions of naira that is going to Nigerian uh, presidential jet. They keep swallowing it. They don't want to maintain the plane. Last week, they reported that uh, 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 your president almost uh, the plane went bad up. Make her no talk the one that go. That YouTube go first. They said last week that the plane <clears throat> was bad up up here. <laughs> that it was so bad that they had to transfer him to another plane to take him to his destination. Huh? And they reported too that why they were transporting him. I thought he thought he was about to go bye bye. They put oxygen on him because they reported that a, a president of Nigeria escaped by, hey, God. So, that one gone. Now, after that incident, your president is missing. President of Federal Republic of Nigeria is missing. Hey, God. Nothing will not go happen for this con. There's nothing that you are looking for. That you cannot find in this in this in this my beautiful country hmm? there's nothing you cannot find there no criminality no evil no nothing that you cannot find there nothing so these people after that day after that one that he he almost spy up he escaped they don't know where he is they say president of nigeria it's nowhere to be found. It's now almost one week now. They don't know where he is. They don't. They don't. They just don't know where he is. The people like Ananu go them that will not let Obi rest. Will not come and tell Nigerians where the president is. They will not come and tell and announce to Nigerians. Okay, I made the Bolatinubu is sick. Uh, I made the Bolatinubu had gone to the hospital. Or I made the Bolatinubu whatever, whatever. Just tell us whatever because you guys have been telling us stupid things and there's nothing we can do. They are not saying anything. So there is this conference that's supposed to ha be happening in Texas. Then they sent your, your shitty man. The, the shitty man, the vice president to go and represent the made of Tinubu so that since they cannot find him. In the middle of A again. I am minding my business and I saw Vice President of Nigeria escape death. I say how? Again? What happened? It was the same plane, the same aeroplane, a Nigerian jet, that he was trying to go to Texas. And in the middle of the air, the thing went back. They ended up taking him back to the country. So another person will represent Nigeria. Uh, wherever it is that 
that they are going in Texas. Have you had that before? People who are so wicked that they, they wicked themselves. They wicked themselves. Or maybe somebody is trying to buy them. I don't know. Somebody is trying to sabotage their plane. Who knows? Mm. I don't know because there's nothing. But if somebody is trying to do it, it will still be their people. It will still be their people because it's only their people that are inside. You mean the trillions and trillions and trillions of money that they are located for the plane to be to be fixed. And it's not being fixed. And they are the ones that will be in those planes. They will be the ones in those planes. So it's not like me and you that we are getting into those planes. But they are so wicked to themselves. They are so wicked because maybe they just want to do the manage, manage, manage. They have not even relaxed to be the president. They have not even relaxed to, to carry the thing that they snatched and grabbed and ran away with it so that they know that the plan it will be for them. They continue to swallow the money. They continue to feed it to snake and everywhere. They are not using it for what it was meant for. Now, the plan stays up and has default. Now, they sent your vice president. Oh, you don't think, you don't believe me uh, when I say it? I beg, make I leave a uh, Oseni, Oseni Rufai, Rufai of uh, Arise News to tell you how this thing happened. Credit to my, to my brother, um, <clears throat> happy Marcel mm -hmm. yeah my brother credit to him for all, because that's his channel that I got this please watch watch and see how these people are sabotaging themselves watch and see how they buy themselves tomorrow now they will say that it's Nigerians that did it when you get something eh, that is not of you when he, when he gets something that is not meant for you eh, anything that is not meant for you and you steal it, you grab it, you run away with it eh you cannot rest because a lot of people are involved a lot of lives are involved and you grab it like this and you think it will it will work for you so you guys just watch when you finish watching just share it so others can see so that they won't be going around be grabbing and running away with people's stuff because that's what they did and they are paying for it including in staying in the air mm -hmm. from me to you thank you so much for watching bye-bye watch those u.s trip as presidential jet develops fault mid-air that's a very sad one what's the maintenance stage and kudos to the pilot that said he was going to quickly bring him back so what's the maintenance like of our presidential fleets? How viable it is? Because this is not the only first time. I think there was another story making the round as regards how the president had to get another charter plane because a plane too had problems. So it's time for us to check mm -hmm. this our presidential fleets properly. We don't want any mishap. We love our president and our vice president so much. We don't want anything to happen to them of some sort. And, you know, they must be able to check all of this fleet and, and get, you know, what the presidential fleet needs for it. So... Currently, as we speak, the eight thereabouts, the okay. president is not still back. We don't know where he is. Uh -huh. I think they should be able to tell us where President Tinubu is because we're not even hearing anything. Because I would have even uh, thought that Bayon Onuga will be able to uh, assure us and tell us where President Tinubu is, and they should even come out with pictures. But now they're not even telling us where he is, and all of a sudden, everybody's just going like uh, nothing happened. So they should be able to tell us where President Tinubu is. Yeah. Uh, Rufai, uh, let's go back a bit to that uh, plane. It was like the jet by itself told them the right thing to do since maybe they weren't listening to people because uh, at the end of that, by the time they said, oh, he had to come back and so on, he will now be home to take care of national affairs and the uh, person in charge of foreign affairs will be the one representing we have to get there before doing the right thing because the president is not around the vp will be traveling when you have somebody who could represent you from the get-go so it makes somebody wonder is it that as uh they would always say we're always wanting to put the the hall or the cart before the horse and at the end of the day we'll now have to retrace our steps in a rather embarrassing way as usual, you know we have a very fire brigade approach. But I think the most important thing is, who are those constantly checking the presidential fleets? With the money's issue for the presidential fleet, who are those checking the presidential fleets? Why is it that we have to now discover something like that, me there? Me there. What if it was a situation we couldn't salvage? I mean, I think those are the pertinent questions we should ask.
so we should be able to ask these questions and get accountability as regards them just like we're also asking where is the president of the federal republic of nigeria we also have a right to him we also have a right to know i mean these are the questions we should be asking if we don't ask that question we don't get accountability and a country cannot grow without a certain, of, a certain level of accountability and the news coming around is that Shetema just escaped another death in the mid-air. This is after one week we reported that Tinubu's jet developed fort in Netherlands while he shattered another commercial flight to Saudi Arabia. This is just one week after Kashin Shetema is escaping another death when the presidential fleet developed fort in the mid-air. What is going on? The other day, I reported that Kashin Shetima has assumed office like acting president and he will be going to represent Tinumbu in so many international events since we have declared Tinumbu missing because the presidency did not tell us his whereabout. But now it's unfortunate that why Kashin Shetima was going to United States of America, the Nigeria presidential jet Devendo fought in the mid-air. Now, the Minister of Foreign Affairs, Yusuf Tuga, will now represent Tinumbu at the 2024 U.S. Africa Business Summit in Dallas, Texas, not Vice President Kashin Shetima, as announced earlier. The Vice President Kashin Shetima, who was originally scheduled to represent the President, was unable to make the trip following a technical fault with the aircraft, forcing him to make a detour on the device of the presidential ethnic. The presidency revealed in a statement signed on Monday evening by the Shetima spokesperson, Mr. Stanley Nkocha. The statement is titled, Minister of Foreign Affairs to now represent Tinumbu at U.S. African Summit. Although details of the particular aircraft the Vice President boarded was not stated, there are indications that the plane is the God's Friend V aircraft often used by the Vice President. Shetima's Predecessor Professor Yemi Osibanjo has used the same aircraft while in office from 2015 to 2023. Since the Buhari years, the presidency had maintained 10 aircraft. They include Boeing Business Jet Boeing 737-800 or Nigeria Air Force 001, which is reportedly under maintenance. One Ghost Friend 550, one Ghost Friend V, Ghost Friend 5. 00, two Falcon 7X, one Hawker Sydney 4000, two Augusta Westland AW137 helicopter, and two Augusta Westland AW101 helicopters. These are the aircrafts and helicopters that the Nigerian presidency have been using for a while now. While the statement did not disclose the nature of the fault, Unkocha said that the vice president has since returned to Abuja and will carry out with other national duties. The high-profile summit taking place at the key Bembe Hodgson Convention Center will bring together political and business leaders from across Africa, the United States, and other regions of the world.